What does Santa Claus really look like? High-level sources tell us that Santa Claus has had a makeover this year. He ditched the roly-poly red suit. The belly doesn't quiver like a bowl full of jelly. That beard now litters the barbershop floor, and Rudolph has been put out to pasture. Santa is still at work, of course. He has merely gone undercover. Agent 007 has nothing on this guy. He shows up in the most unlikely places at the least logical times. Not long ago, there was a secret Santa sighting in East Idaho, where a selfless computer teacher at a local charter school was hard-pressed, dealing with multiple health and financial challenges. She cared for aging, ailing parents and a legally blind adult daughter. She supported her teen-egged son and was coping with two egging vehicles which both needed to be put out to pasture. She was trying her best but was up against it when the doorbell rang. Secret Santa handed her a large check and the keys to a new Toyota Revy 4. Then there was the Idaho high school principal who received an anonymous donation large enough to cover the cost of her husband's kidney transplant. Sure enough, Secret Santa and the West African student at an East Idaho college with not enough money to pay for his tuition and medical costs of his soccer damaged, surgically repaired knees. Santa gave him a thousand dollar check, a thousand dollar grocery gift card and paid for an entire semester of his tuition. Would you believe it if we told you that same secret Santa helped meet still more financial needs in East Idaho, like supporting the parents of a 27-week premature baby, gifting $5,000 to the mother of a special needs child, and delivering a $3,000 riding mower to a financially challenged elderly couple who had invested their lives in blessing other people? If you've noticed in East Idaho, connection in all of these mysterious sightings, you are quite perceptive. According to Breitbart.com, Santa enlisted the help of the elves at the East Idaho News to locate local recipients worthy of sharing in his $1 million Christmas giveaways. So, that territory is pretty well covered, but other secret Santas are also hard at work, delivering 5,500 turkeys to West Michigan, food banks, helping Alabama, teenagers, raise the money to take their impoverished family to a local festival, and welcoming U.S. military personnel who served in Vietnam as guests of honor each Veterans Day at a Washington, D.C. bar run by Vietnamese American owners. Anywhere the spirit of love lives, you'll find a secret Santa. The odds are good you'll blow his cover when you look at yourself in the mirror. Our job at Restoring Justice U.S. is to prevent history from repeating itself. Learn more of what we are doing and how you can help.